hi guys what's up welcome back to our techies and in this video i will gonna show you how to install custom rom in your samsung galaxy note 2 so before it started i will uh, uh recommend from three different things that your phone battery must be charged above 60 percent second your phone is must be rooted and third your phone must be rooted with uh supported uh, supported recovery CWM recovery so if it's not supported then your phone uh, phones means this uh, custom ROM will not start and if your phone is not rooted yet you can uh, check my uh, description there is a link for a video which will help you to root your phone so now let's start so first of all uh, this is the uh, current android version of this phone it's android 4.4.2 running on kitkat which is the latest uh, which is the last version of note 2 and to install custom rom you require these two files and must you must need to copy these two files in your sd card so there is the firmware the rex uh, resurrection remix this is the uh, custom room uh, this is the developers name of the custom room and another was cm13 means can you uh, sign on gen mode this was another uh, developer and to install a uh, google apps this you need to download this g apps here so let's start now so first turn off your phone Okay. Now uh, hold the volume up, power and the home key. Okay. So it's now a uh, team win. So team win recovery. So this is a touch recovery for that. I'm using so First of all, uh, wipe the data of the phone. Wipe data. Yes. Also format. It will be. Uh, there is uh, no chance to be any kind of error. So it's. Uh, so do the uh, format first. So it's formatting. Okay, now it's completed. So go back, back, back. Now install the zip files. External storage. Okay. First, I have to install the firmware, just like uh, Resurrection Remix. I'm not. Uh, I'm not installing now this uh, Sinonjet. So first, installing this Resurrex and install it. Let's see. And I'm also not uh, going to fast forward this video or like uh, uh, delete any any parts of the video. I will just like to show you how much time will take in during this whole process. And uh, just like if I face any uh, error or like any uh, error occurs, then it will I will also show it to you. So now they flashing super soon now. So I think it's it will gonna complete okay now it's successfully flashed you can see now back to home again install the uh, okay okay 
install now G apps. So now which G apps you need to install? So there is I downloaded three. One is the Aroma, second one is the Micro, and third one is Stock. This Stock G apps will not work in uh, Note 2. You have to install Aroma or Micro. Basically, Aroma uh, you in the Aroma you need to you have option to select all the different kinds of uh, apps which you need to select but in micro all the necessary google apps will install so i am selecting now uh, micro so let's start so now installing this uh, flashing the uh, g apps now this uh, installing this g apps will take around ten, uh, five minutes hardly i think see Okay, 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 okay. Installing this one thing. Installing. Now it's installing uh, swipe leaps, calendar googles, dialer frame, frameworks. So installation complete now. So now this installation complete. So click home and reboot the system. Reboot the system. So while rebooting, it's better to remove uh, the SD card from the phone. It will uh, not now stuck on because uh, there is uh, above sixty percent chance exist to uh, stuck on the bootloader screen. Means this resurrection screen after uh, uh, means uh, connecting of all apps data like it will stuck on start apps means if you if the this sd card remains in the phone then the phone will stuck on the start app start apps so i already uh, removed this sd card so now let's see how much time it will take to boot up Okay, now this.
uh, if this phone is stuck on this uh, uh, restoring contacts then you just uh, do one thing uh, just uh, remove the battery and again plugged it and then turn on your phone it will definitely on and I'm also will do that if it's in 30 seconds it will not on I will also do it will do that let's see okay now after this that so i also now i'm going to remove the battery and i will be back after that so now it's uh, after removing the battery and again plugged in so now it's on so it's now on the welcome screen so let's quick uh, uh, set over that okay okay next Okay, I think touch is something. Prob okay, now it's working. Okay. And I will also uh, give the full review about this custom room on my next video. So you can just uh, check the video here. There is. I will also provide you the link below the uh, video. You can see the review. Is it stable or not a stable room? So let's see the. So Let's again skip that. Checking info. Skip. Skip. Next. Next. Okay. Not now. Okay. Sorry. Okay. Where it is. It is not now. Okay, use the Google Now Launcher I, and now I'm on the screen, home screen, so here it is, so now the it's ready, okay, first let's turn off the mobile data, okay, now let me the setting, go to the setting and the battery is now 81% as you can see, so now let's uh, first uh, quick uh, show this setting. about phone and now you can see this is uh, android 6.0.1 of resurrection remix so tap over it so it's android marshmallow and uh, when you push over that there is some small games <laughs> a small game like that push over turn it back over that so this is the way in that way you can easily install a custom room in your phone in just in 15 minutes or 20 minutes hardly so thanks for watching this video if you like my video please click on click on thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and share my channel stay tuned